Good evening, WWE Universe, and welcome to another edition of WWE Slam. I'm your host, The Revolution, joined as ever by Byron Saxon, Michael Cole, and the devilishly delightful Corey Graves. You join us here this evening in the heart of Orlando, just two short weeks away from our Summer Slam pay-per-view, which is heating up by the second. With two major matches already confirmed for the hottest event of the summer, what else will be confirmed for this year's pay-per-view here this evening as we continue on our road to Summer Slam? All that and more will become clear this evening right here on WWE Slam. It would seem that Stephanie McMahon is intent on making Vicky Guerrero change her ways here in WWE Slam after seemingly ignoring Vicky's warnings last week. Unfortunately, Raquel Diaz will be the one to feel a punishment here this evening as she defends her Slam Women's Championship in two back-to-back matches against opponents of Stephanie McMahon's choosing. Will we see a brand new Women's Champion crown before we even reach the Slam? Stay tuned to WWE Slam for our main event of the evening. However, up next, Becky Lynch takes on rival Naomi after tag team partner Charlotte managed to pin Sasha Banks last week. Could another victory for Lynch and Flair be rewarded with a championship rematch at SummerSlam? That match, people, is up next. Lynch's chances here tonight. Well, she definitely has her hands full, but I think you might be right, Michael. Becky absolutely can walk away with the win here tonight. Well, to say she looks ready to go here might just be an understatement. 
Yeah, Cole, she's been looking forward to this one for a very long time. It sounds like this crowd has been, too. This will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. No one's backing down here. What an impasse. Naomi going for it. A little jealousy perhaps as she goes for the face. Let's briefly talk about Naomi. For those that haven't seen her, what is she going to do here to try and win? Sometimes I think Naomi is too preoccupied with her dancing, but hey, she's looking to impress me. Here's a great opportunity for her. Naomi has one of the most thrilling, dare I say, illuminating entrances in sports entertainment. But that's only the beginning, because when the bell rings, Naomi is truly amazing. She's looking at it early. Not sure what made her think now is a good time for a pin attempt. What a kick out. Naomi's athleticism brings the WWE Universe shooting to their feet in excitement as this superstar turns the ring into her own dance party, though Naomi's opponent is not happy that they were invited. Bright lights, high energy, and amazing moves sum up Naomi before she enters the ring. And when the matchup begins, no matter who the competition is, Naomi's gonna shine. Lynch may be slowing some here, but this certainly isn't something she can't come back from. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. But it's still early here, guys. It's going to take a whole heck of a lot more than this to keep her down. A few inches off there. Inches? She missed by at least a foot, Cole. Comes up big with the reversal. She's not playing any games tonight. Everyone better watch out. Even me. That triangle choke cuts the blood flow to the brain, folks. So we're going to see somebody unconscious real soon if it lasts. Reverses that one. Ooh.
This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. We're looking at complete domination here. Going to have a hard time. She reverses out of it. And not a second too soon. Close call there. What's the next move for Naomi to turn things around quickly to remain in this thing? Her hopes of winning this match may very well be in jeopardy. I really expected much more from her here tonight. I'm pretty... It's got a cinched in the disarmor! Now that's what I call making a statement. Geez, I don't like Naomi's chances. This might be it. One, two... Naomi's still able to kick out there. Incredible. Just power out. We have Naomi on the attack. Just a matter of time now before this superstar goes for the finisher. And when that happens, you can bet this one's over. Now it's Becky Lynch fading a bit. Looks like her chances of winning this match are starting to dwindle. It looks to me, guys, like she may have underestimated her opponent here tonight, and now she's paying for it. And for her sake, you just hope this isn't the beginning of the end for her, especially considering it's been such a tightly fought contest up to this point. Split leg moonsault! This could be the turning point. Can she do it here? She's looking to get out of here with a win early. She got her shoulder up, and we continue. She's got her in her sights. There it is. It is. It's locked in. Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. And that's the match. Here is your winner, Naomi. Took on some damage there, but was still able to pick up the win. There's few things more humiliating than tapping out to your opponent. Still to come here this evening on WWE Slam, Raquel Diaz puts her Slam Women's Championship on the line as she defends her title in two back-to-back -back matches against mystery opponents. Will a brand new champion be crowned right here this evening? Stay tuned to find out. However, up next, Nia Jax looks to make quick work of Sonya Deville as it was announced earlier this evening that either Jax or Karma will be the one to determine which match these giants compete in at this year's SummerSlam. With Nia first out of the gate, will she manage to make quick work of Sonya Deville? That match, people, is up next. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from San Diego, California, Maya Jax. We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show. Determined looks on these faces of these women for sure, wouldn't you agree, Byron? Absolutely, but that shouldn't come as any surprise, especially considering how intense the women's division is right now.
her opponent from Hackensack, New Jersey, Sonia Devin. There is an absolutely big fight feel in the arena tonight for this one. Yeah, and judging from the vibe here currently, it seems to me like this is the one this sold out crowd came to see. Byron, many people are saying that these women are the top competitors in the division. Would you agree with that assessment? Well, the women's division certainly is stacked right now, Michael. But yeah, these competitors definitely stand out when thinking about the top women in the industry. This is it, the moment we've been waiting for. The time for talking is behind us. Now these two superstars will test one another's abilities and will like never before. This is about being the best. And guys, I'm pretty sure I can watch these women compete each and every week. And it's worth noting that we are just a few miles from the WWE Performance Center, which means there are plenty of WWE hopefuls in the back studying this one. Let's take a moment to discuss Nia Jax. We know she can compete, but how is she going to actually win this thing? My advice to the fans at home is to not even blink. If you do, you're going to regret it. I can promise you that. Another thing is, she has all the tools to be a great one in this division. We'll see how well she develops from here. Ooh. I don't think during her pre-match preparation she expected that. Well done. Uh-oh, this doesn't look good, Byron. Yeah, this is how people end up getting hurt. Back in from the floor. She's flirting with a count out here, guys. Come on, hurry up. Get back in there. Ill-advised move. Here's Nia Jax with some offense of her own. Not looking good for her right now. She doesn't want to let this get out of control, guys. Well, she really can't afford to take on too much more damage and still be able to execute effectively in there. Nia Jax able to avoid damage there. What a shot by Nia Jax. Unleashes the Boston Crab. Could be over soon here. by Nia Jax. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Oh, 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 oh what a leg drop. Oh, at least my stomach hurt. Wow, she's found her way all the way back here. Looking for the win. Oh, man. That looks like it hurts. She's back in full control now. Will this be it? Flattened by a vicious splash. And this has got to be it. Once again, thank you for tuning into this great women's matchup. We're looking at complete domination here. One. Bringing it back into the ring.
Folks, if you want to... She counters before it's too late. Oh, man. And she turns it around on her. Well, she wants this win bad. She's looking at it early. She's starting to get on a roll. We may be looking at a power bomb here. That's exactly what it looks like to me, Cole. Oh man, she's rolling now. Back now inside the ring. Bringing it back between the ropes. Drop the bomb on me. A power bomb, that is. One, two. And there's a kick out at two and a half. What a match. She is on fire. A clubbing clothesline. She's struggling big time here, guys. Of course she is, Cole. She's getting destroyed. Wow, is there nothing she can't do? Oh, and she has an answer for that one. So strong. Fireman's carry. I think we're at the point in this match where the finisher could be used at any moment here. Oh, oh my lord! Man, she knows how to make a comeback. Let's look at that one again, guys. Cole, she might win this thing right here. This could do it. One, two, three. The pinfall and the victory. Here is your winner, Maya Jax. You heard the ring announcer. Here we go. Here's Nia Jax, not letting up on her. Oh man, she's rolling now. So strong. Fireman's carry. Slam it into the mat. Oh, so hazardous to your health, too. Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. That just echoed throughout this entire arena. Oh, man. That looks like it hurts. That has got to be it. Look at this. Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. Still to come ahead this evening on WWE Slam, Kyla looks to defeat Emma in quick succession to Nia Jax after Nia defeated Sonya Deville just moments ago. Will Kyla somehow manage to pin Emma in a quicker time limit than Nia Jax? With a match stipulation on the line, Kyla is bound to give Emma one hell of a beating. However, up next, the Iconics continue their Help the Aged scheme as they look to add to their bragging rights. However, up next, the Iconics continue their Help the Age scheme as they look to add to their bragging rights.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, accompanied by Peyton Royce, representing the iconic duo from Sydney, Australia, Billy Kay. Here comes a truly iconic competitor, at least that's what she thinks, Billy Kay. Billy Kay's definitely got a bit of an ego, Michael, but I'll tell you, she definitely has the skills in the ring to back it up. Tell me, Corey, what should we expect to see from her here tonight? Well, Cole, my sources are telling me that she's been working on a few new offensive moves. I can't confirm that we'll... And her opponent from California, Terry. One on one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. And I'd say this match will go a very long way in determining just who is WWE's most dominant woman. It definitely will, Cole. But at the same time, whoever wins here tonight can't just rest on her laurels. There's a whole locker room full of women looking to take that top spot. Oftentimes in our business, the only way for personal issues to be ultimately resolved is two superstars enter the squared circle and go one-on-one -on -one in a good old-fashioned wrestling match. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. Judging from this crowd response, guys, there's no more magical place to be in Orlando right now than right here for this match. Just a vicious bulldog. Give me some thoughts on Terry. What can our newer viewers expect from this woman? She's certainly a force, Cole, but you have to remember who she's in the ring with there, too. Neither of these girls are pushovers, that's for sure. One thing I can say about her is if she does get beat, it won't be because of a lack of preparation or effort. Billy Kay's on the attack now. Quick pin attempt here, and the kick out. Still seems a little early. She wants this win bad. Terry may be starting to fade here. This one appears far from over, and she knows that. You know, she's the kind of competitor that actually likes getting hit. It motivates her. And this might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. My math says this one's pretty much down the middle at this point though her ego likely has her believing she's winning. She's looking at it early. Didn't have to dig very deep to kick out of that one. It's gonna take more than that to keep her down. Not this time. I've never seen her miss by so much. Four. She's on a roll now. She is on fire. Five. Looks like Six. she wants to beat her inside the ring. And she turns it around on her. She just slapped the taste out of her mouth. She comes up big with a reversal. Working the leg here. And there's the counter.
dropped like a bad habit. She's in control. Connects with a counter. Looks like she's starting to stumble a bit. She needs to find a way to get back on the offensive here. I really expected much more from her here tonight. I'm pretty shocked to see her absorb so much punishment. What? You can see a quick finish. Can she do it? Billy Kay looking for something big here. Look at her go. This is another example of the carnage this beauty can create. What an unbelievable slam. I think we're at the point in this match where the she shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. And now she's on the offensive. She's having a hard time getting back to her feet, guys. Well, she's absorbed a lot of punishment so far tonight. Very difficult position to be in right now. Yeah, situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. She counters with a move of her own. Oh, and she gets floored by that one. Yeah, there's no staying on your feet after something like that. With action like this, it's no wonder Raw has been around as long as it has. Okay, now she's just showing off. She's going for the cover. Big reversal for her there. Going with the she's got the shoulders down. more punishment needs to be dished out. Just finish it. Her opponent is clearly getting the best of her here. She's obviously not looking great right now, guys, but if she can somehow execute her finisher again, she'll be walking away from this match with her arm raised in victory. Mark my words. These women have gone through so much in this match. It's amazing that they're still able to stand. Look at this. Drops her with authority. Wow, that was intense. Just heaved across the ring there. She drops her hard. What an amazing display of athleticism. At this point, it looks like even the winner of this match will walk out of here beaten and battered. We've got an argument on our hands. Oh, it's just a few words. No big deal. And it's reversed. Having a tough time getting back up here. As you would expect, given what she's been through here tonight. Both of these superstars looking a little worse for wear right now. An amazing match so far, guys, but it looks... The swing! 
This should do it right there. And she's still not moving. I don't think she can recover from this goal. Looks to me like these superstars are running on fumes right about now. Big miss right there. She wasn't even close, Michael. Looking for the win. A mammoth slam right there, guys. And she looked like she had no chance just a few moments ago. Will this be it? She's in a bad way here. Bottom line, she's got to get up. She can't win this match on her back. Takes her off her feet with a tackle. Shoulders down. This could be it. There's the pinfall and the victory. Here is your winner, Billy Kay. And there's your winner here in this singles match. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. And her opponent, from New York, Melandra. Big time singles matches on deck here, and Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. But her opposition here tonight is incredibly dangerous and simply cannot be overlooked. Agreed. But I don't think she's overlooking anybody, Cole. That's not the kind of competitor she is. The collar and elbow tie up in a battle for control here. Whoa, and a bit of a test of strength here. How about we touch on Melandra a bit? For those that haven't seen her, what is she going to do here to try and win? When you have two competitors this talented and focused, it's anybody's guess how it's going to shake out. Another thing is, she has all the tools to be a great one in this division. We'll see how well she develops from here. So damaging. What an amazing display of power.
Hoping to end it early. Two, three. That's it. The match is over. Here is your winner, Peyton Royce. A very decisive victory here tonight. I got a feeling we're gonna be talking about her for a long time to come. I have to say, I honestly thought Terry Runnels had Miss Money in the Bank. Billy had beaten there for a moment, but regardless of the result, both Alundra Blaze and Terry Runnels are looking better than ever, and it seems like neither of those competitors have missed a beat. Unfortunately, however, this seems to have only added to the iconic ego here in WWE Slam as during the ad break, the iconic duo sent out an open tag team challenge to two former WWE superstars. Will a mystery tag team finally knock the iconics off their throne? Tune in to WWE Slam next week to find out. However, up next, Karma looks set to take out Emma in quick time as she looks to secure her choice of stipulation at this year's SummerSlam. Will Karma walk out victorious, or will Nia Jax be the one to pick up the stipulation for this highly anticipated match? That match, people, starts now. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Melbourne, Australia, Emma. Here comes a woman who is constantly evolving, Emma. I gotta say though, Michael, some of that evolving has been positively head scratching. I mean, what was the deal with Emmalina? Guys, a win here would go a long way in proving that she is as good as she claims to be. And on the flip side, Cole, a loss could be very damaging to her long-term goals. And her opponent, from California, Awesome Car. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. And what about this crowd reaction, guys? Yeah, the WWE Universe is definitely ready to see these women square off. And I can't say that I blame them. This is it, guys. We're ready to get in full control now. Unless things change soon, this match is over. She lifts her up and over. Got her with the elbow. Wow, that overhand punch started down behind his feet and just kept coming. What do you think's going through Cobb's mind? For those that haven't seen her, what is she going to do here to try and win? Well, I don't think it's a shock to see her doing so well for herself, but she's going to have to stay sharp. The competition in the women's division is fierce right now. One thing I can say about her is if she does... Down! 
with a face buster. There it is. A trip to the local medical facility might be in order after that. Can she do it here? There's the pinfall and the victory. Here is your winner, Awesome Call. There's no doubt about it. That's a big pinfall win right there. I could watch them go at it each and every week. What a match. What a great match we just saw here on Raw. Thank you to everybody at home for choosing to spend part of your Monday night with us. Well, there we have it. Kama will be the one to pick the stipulation between herself and Nia Jax at this year's SummerSlam. We can only predict that Nye will somehow have the odds stacked against her thanks to Karma who will make her decision right here in WWE Slam next week. However, we must now switch our focus to the main event of the evening as Raquel Diaz defends her Slam Women's Championship in not one but two back-to-back -back championship matches. Are we about to crown a new champion here in WWE Slam? Our main event starts now. Making her way to the ring from El Paso, Texas, the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Diaz. One-on-one -on -one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one we won't soon forget. Totally agree, Michael. When you have two superstars as hungry as these two competing in the ring, you can bet it'll be memorable. Corey, in terms of raw talent, where do you think these women rank as it relates to the other competitors in the division? Oh, they're right there at the top, Cole. Years from now, I think we're going to look back at these women and realize just how lucky we were to watch them compete. That's how talented they are.
Introducing the challenger from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Akira. Introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas. She is the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Diaz. Hope you're ready. It's go time, fellas. You know, I can't remember the last time I was this excited for a championship match. And with the title on the line, both of these superstars look like they brought their A-game here tonight. She got her with the drop kick. Let's touch on Diaz a bit. What's your take on the champ? Actually, let's talk about both competitors. They clearly know the magnitude of this match, and both came into this match in tremendous condition. Right about now, she's wondering if being a champion is all it's cracked up to be. Tough matchup. Oh, no. She's looking to end it early. Looking for the quick pin. No trouble getting out of that one. She's not done yet. And the elbow drop hits. Three. Lands the elbow drop. Four. Five. That'll rearrange your face. Six. She wants to do this in the ring. Absolutely has to get back in the ring. There's no way around it. The challenger's taking on some offense. But you can bet she won't let this golden opportunity slip away now. Guys, this is where all that self-respect she has pays off. Sure, she's taking on some offense, but she's confident enough in her game to bounce back. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. She is on fire. Oh, and she gets out of the way. Oh, and she has an answer for that one. Punishing attack on the body. She dodges that one. The challenger not in a great place. This is not where she wants to be if she wants to become champion. I don't care how much of an expert you are in this business, nobody could have seen this match going this way. Nobody. Will this be enough? We know what's coming here. Gory bomb, gory bomb. There is no cup. Can she do it here? I can't believe the referee didn't see that. Having a tough time getting back up here, as you would expect given what she's been through here tonight.
The challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. This is not where she wants to be if she wants to walk out of this match with the gold. By the looks of things, this may very well be the beginning of the end for her. The Regal Cutter! What a comeback! She's countering nicely now. Yeah, a second ago, she was almost done. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Two, three. The champ retains. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. A big opportunity for her here, Corey, as the gold could be going home with her tonight. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that tonight is the night we crown a new champion. That's how impressed I've been by her of late. Introducing the challenger from Scottsdale, Arizona, Brie Bella. Introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas. She is the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Diaz. Plant your butts in those seats and get ready. This could be all she wrote. She drops her hard. This one's over, guys. This isn't good. And this has got to be it. The champion is victorious. Talk about domination. I am shocked, Michael. Completely incredible. This has to be it. You gotta think that that will end Bree's night here. Toss to the outside.
Thanks for tuning in to WWE Slam. As always, I've been your host of Revolution, and we hope you've enjoyed tonight's episode of WWE Slam. Be sure to leave a comment below, tweet us at Revolution, or head on over to www.therevolution.co.uk to keep up with all things WWE Slam. Tune in next week to see what's in store for the Women of Slam, because you never know who might turn up. Until next time...